morning guys and welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another video um yes i know i haven't uploaded in a while um i have a few videos planned to film today so i don't know if this is gonna go out first or if um another video is gonna go out first but if this is the first one i apologize um i haven't uploaded since like mid late last year um basically i just ran out of time and I was just feeling very unmotivated to film. I didn't know what I wanted to film, so I didn't. Um, but a lot has changed. Not a lot, a lot, but there's a few things that's changed since then. So that's what I'm going to catch you guys up on today. I have a few things to do. It's already like 10.30, so I've been up, I've had breakfast, I've gotten ready. Um, the first thing I'm going to do today, because I kind of just want to get it over and done with, I need to take off my SNS. Um, I've had these on for almost two months. I did one hand last night. It took me so long that I only did one hand and then I wanted to go to bed. Um, but look how short my fingers look without SNS. These are my natural nails. That's my, like, they're my nails. They've just got the SNS on top. Um, but once I take the SNS off, I have to cut them all the way down because the SNS makes them I don't know if it's the SNS that makes them really thin or when I go and get my nails done they use like the little electric drill I'm pretty sure that's what like thins them out so I decided that I would take them off myself I've had SNS for about two years now um I'll just usually get like keep getting them done every time they grow out but I've decided that this year the beginning of the year I want to kind of give my nails a little bit of a break and see if I can grow them out naturally um, and also it'll save me like $55 every time I want to get my nails done. I don't have to spend that money. Um, and it definitely adds up over the years. So that's what's happening. I'm going to try and take them off. Um, it takes a while because you have to kind of wrap them up in the cotton uh, thing with nail polish remover and foil. And then you have to file them down and it's, it's a process. Um, but that's what I want to get done this morning. And then I have a few other things to do. But right now... I just want to get my nails off. Okay, so I've got my foil on my fingers. I filed down like the top layer. And now I'm just going to let this soak for like 15 minutes. And then we'll see if they come off. I just took off my nails. My fingers look so short. Um, it took me about an hour to do one hand. So if you're going to take off SNS nails at home, um, make sure you do it when you have a lot of time. So today is Saturday, um, I think mom and I are going to go to Ikea because she wants to buy this stand thing for her plants because she likes to plant cactuses. So we're going to do that and I also want to pick up some like containers and boxes and stuff because I need to organize my desk drawer and then I also want to find a box that I can put all my Mimco pouches in because I have so many. And I just need a better way of organizing them and just some other like organizing things that I want to buy. I don't want to spend too much money though. So um, I'm going to try not go too crazy. And I also kind of want to go to Starbucks because there's a Starbucks near the Ikea that we go to. So we'll see if that ends up happening. Um, but I kind of wanted to sit down for a second and give you guys a little life update since um, I haven't spoken to you in a while so um, basically the biggest change that I've made since I've last uploaded is that I've decided to study this year I'm studying social media marketing and it is an all online course so I can kind of complete it in my own time and whenever I want um, I am working full-time at the moment but I have resigned my position as a manager so I will be moving down to a casual position after the 21st of February so I'll still be working within the same company I just won't be a manager anymore um, which is really sad because I've you know worked with this team for I think three years so I will miss them but I gotta move on to bigger and better things um, I'm hoping to pick up an internship at some point this year as well just to kind of get my foot in the door somewhere because I feel like I've been applying for jobs for so long and just haven't been getting anywhere so I thought I would study something else I did study fashion business and now I'm doing social media marketing so just trying to you know gain some more skills and learn some more things and see where that takes me so that's what I'm doing this year 
I will also have a lot more time to film and do stuff for Instagram and business bombshells and I feel like, I don't know, I've been working full time for so long and I feel like I have no time for anything else. Like I'll plan like workouts for the week and then by the time I get home after work, I'll get home at like 6 o'clock. I don't want to work out and I don't want to study. I kind of just want to relax after being at work all day. So it's really like taking up a lot of my time and energy. Um, but I feel like once I'm casual and I'm not working every single day of the week, I will be able to do a lot more that I want to do. Um, so I'm really excited for that and I'm excited to film and bring you guys along on the journey to see what happens and where I go. I also wanted to ask you guys if you would like me to do kind of a weekly series. I have two ideas. I want to do kind of like a, um, actually no, three ideas. I want to do like an organizational, is that a word? I want to organize my whole life. I want to like clear out my wardrobe, organize all that, kind of like a Maria Kondo kind of situation. I want to reorganize my desk, everything in my room, just so like everything kind of has its place. Um, so I was thinking of doing like a different video for kind of each section of my room. Um, and then I also want to do like a workout, getting into fitness kind of series because I work out every now and then, not as often as I should. And my eating is like 80% healthy. So I kind of want to do a series on that um, and do like the full Sarah's Day, sweat it to shred it, um, go to the gym, that kind of thing. Um, and then my third one was kind of like a, a, I don't know how to explain it, but I would like to do weekly or like bi-weekly videos on like, I don't know, like confidence and like self-love, um, like mental health issues just like kind of things like that like I would obviously send out to you guys ask me questions or like give me a topic that you would like me to talk about or give you advice on and then each week or every second week do a video on that um, yeah so that way that'll kind of give me a lot of content if I'm like doing the three series at the same time I kind of have a few videos um, at a time that I can upload so I'll have a lot of content so let me know what you think about those um, down in the comments and what you would like me to do. And if you have any ideas of like topics you would want me to talk about, let me know down in the comments and I'll definitely put that into a video. So, we're on our way to Ikea. Kevin's mom just stuck and get Starbucks. I got a vanilla iced latte for blonde espresso on soy milk. Love a complicated coffee order. Mom got... Um, so yeah, we're gonna go right here. It's good. It's good. Yeah. Um, this is really good quality. I haven't vlogged on this one yet. This is my new friend. Not new, but... Which you haven't seen yet. <laughs> um, so yeah, we're gonna... <gasps> you're gonna do nearly a red light. Oh, it's okay. The cut. Tempted to get all of these pink plates and bowls for when I move out. They're so cute. I like the pink. Okay, so we just finished at Ikea. Um, we didn't end up getting the thing that mum wanted because it wouldn't have fit in my car because my car's too little. Um, so we're probably just going to buy it for her birthday instead. Um, but I got some things to organise my room. Huh. Now we're going to get some lunch. Are we going to get lunch? Or are we just going to eat at home? We did. Imagine if we had bought that thing and if we thought like, oh yeah, it'll fit. It would have come us. So I'm back home now. Um, and I have just had lunch and I've been watching The Bold Type. I started watching that ages ago, but then I kind of lost interest for a while and then I've literally been watching nothing but Friends for the past, like, year. Um, so I thought I would get back into it. I was going to restart from the beginning, but I just decided to start from season two instead. Um, so I thought I would show you guys what I got from Ikea. I'm going to start a little bit of organizing. So I got this um, little plastic thing to put in my desk. 
I hope it fits. Um, I think it's meant for like a kitchen drawer, but I'm gonna put like some pens and stuff in here and then other stuff in there. Hopefully it fits. And then I also got this. So it's just a bunch of like little boxes and then it has one big one as well. Or I think two big ones. So again, just to try and keep everything organized. And then for my wardrobe, I got this thing. So this, there's no picture of it on here. I don't, oh here. It's like a little drawing. Um, but this is like the thing, it hangs up in your wardrobe. So I can put like, I can fold up clothes and put them in there or shoes. Um, just because I have literally like five things to a hanger in my wardrobe so hopefully to try and clear up some space I hope it fits um, and then I've got this for my pouches so this is just like a little felt box that you kind of have to put together yourself so I'm gonna make this now while I'm watching the bowl type and then um, see if my pouches fit in there so this is the after So I've got some like post-it notes in here. I've got my passport and just a little notebook. I've got some sticky notes, some paper clips, all my pens and pencils. I've got some magazines that I like to keep to use in like flat lays and stuff. And then I've just got a little bit of makeup. I've got my Morphe palette, um, some mascara foundation and the little Frank highlight glow because I keep my makeup at the moment in this mecha box on my desk because they're really cute and I don't want to throw them out so that's where I keep all of like my everyday makeup um, yes. so I just made some breakfast I have my coffee I have some eggs and I have some apples as well okay so good morning it's the next day um, this is really bright I have just had my breakfast, which I showed you guys. Um, I just finished getting dressed. I just threw on this dress from Shopo, and I'm just about to film a little haul because I have some stuff that I want to show you guys, and I could put it in this video, but I kind of want to do a separate haul video. Um, so it's a bit random. Some of it's clothing that I've bought, some of it's stuff that I got for Christmas, some of it is stuff that, um, people have sent me so I thought I would just put it all in one video and do a haul video because I haven't done one in a while and I like filming them so I'm gonna do that um, it is also the Grammys today so I need to figure out how I can watch them I need to find a live stream or something I can watch because I want to see Ariana's performance um, and then I have to do some studying today because I haven't done any studying this week at all so I need to do that and some other things, but we'll see. All right, so I finished filming. I've changed into something super comfy, my friend's t-shirt. I managed to find a live stream for the Grammys. Um, Twitch is where it's at. I literally searched everywhere on Twitter, Googling for ages. I signed up for this random thing that I think I might've paid for. A lot of the Twitch streamers throughout the Grammys were talking too much, but this guy seems to be okay. Someone on there just asked him to be quiet. Like, there's an ad on right now. But someone asked him to not talk through the Grammys. But he said that he has to commentate a little bit. Because apparently it violates laws or something. If he's just, like, straight up streaming the Grammys. Um, so, so far so good. Um, Jonas Brothers just performed. And Lizzo just won another Grammy. So, I'm excited. Now I feel like I'm not going to do any studying or anything else today. Or editing or anything until the Grammys are over. Because I just want to watch them. Um, but Ariana looks like a princess. She's wearing this ginormous ball gown. She's so beautiful. I'm so excited to see her perform. They're going to come back on. So I'm going to go grab a little snack and watch the Grammys for a bit. Um, sorry for the bad lighting, but we're making dinner now. Um, we're making a little nourish goodness bowl. So we're just throwing in some carrots, cauliflower, beans, broccoli, rice, halloumi, spinach. Anything else? Just a bunch of veggies and rice in a bowl. And it's really good. Okay, 
Okay, so this is my dinner. So we've got the little mix that we just made with like rice. Um, it's got halloumi and a bunch of veggies in it. And then I've just got a bit of avocado and then I've got some of these like meatballs as well. They're really good. So I think I'm going to go ahead and call it a day with the vlog. Um, I don't really have anything else planned. I might just maybe do a workout and then I just need to edit this vlog and edit the haul that I filmed today. So I'm out. Um, thank you guys for watching. So if there's anything else you would like to see from me down in the comments. Um, I love you guys so much and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.